Welcome back, everybody. It's Jeff again with JK Stay in Vegas, and it's another Where's My Coffee? Where's My Room? This time, we're at another station property way on the east side of town. Not the greatest neighborhood, and this is the first time for me to check out Boulder Station Casino. We're going to get inside and check it out, see if it's worth your time. Maybe you want to stay here when voiding the strip or something else. If you've just been curious about Boulder Station, just like I am, you'll want to get inside and check it out for yourself. As we do, Where's My Coffee? Where's My Room? For Boulder Station Casino. All right, everybody, let's get this tour started of Boulder Station Hotel and Casino. Again, a station's property. You'll see some similarities to Sunset Station. One thing you're gonna notice when we first walk in is that like the registration isn't right in front of you. It is a wall of machines. Let me show you, look at this. I've never seen this before. It was just a wall as soon as you walk in. All right, let's head off to the right. Registration's off to our left. First stop on our right-hand side is Bingo. I think this place right here used to be maybe a little Kino section, but nothing now. All right, here is some Bingo. Looks pretty good. And their poker room right over here. And there are just a multitude of machines here. I turned to our right, but it's just a, a door to go out with more machines. Another stop over here is the Burger King. And unlike Sunset Station, this casino is packed, and I mean packed, with machines. Here's the uh, STN Sports Bar and uh, Race Book. Very typical of station casinos. All right, there is the live venue over there on the left. We'll see that in a few minutes. Down here, keep it on our right-hand side. They have a really good happy hour here too at Game On. I'll tell you about that in a few minutes. It's just another exit to go outside. But there are just so many machines in here. All right, we're gonna continue on our right here. It's crazy, isn't it? I mean, it is wall-to-wall -wall of machines. So coming over here, you got some restrooms right here and you got their Regal Theaters. They got 11 theaters and then they got the obligatory Kids Quest. And then the parking garage is right over here. Let's keep looping around. Hey folks, if you're enjoying this video and this tour, please hit that thumbs up and subscribe to J&K Stay in Vegas. All right, let's get back to the video. Continue on down here. It's machines, machines everywhere. This is Brewer's Bar over here, a little hole in the wall place. This is very much a locals casino. And um, despite being in the area that it's in, uh, there are some nice houses on the outskirts. So it is a popular local place. And we got a gift shop here and let's keep going. So game on, Monday through Friday, 3 to 10, Saturday, Sunday, 9 a.m. to 10 p.m. right there. And let's head over to our right. Another door that leaves outside. So this is where your hotel guest elevators are, back here. And we'll show you where the closest place to get coffee is. And it says, Hungry, we've got the cure. And this is a new food hall. I'm not sure how long it's been open, but on the website it says it's brand new. So that could be at any time, right? But they got TVs, it's nice and well lit. Well, they got the Spanish ice cream. They got teriyaki madness. Teriyaki madness, get the spicy chicken. That's a recommendation from J&K. Sabaro pizza, Taco Zell Pastor. It's a really nice lighting here. The hotel and casino, is really nice as they get in here. They do a good job of keeping the riffraff out. But here's Wayne Style, Capiratis, with their famous uh, Thanksgiving sandwich. But, but this uh, food hall is open till about 11 o'clock at night. A couple of places are till midnight. Food is always a good idea. And look at this. Here's Starbucks here. So here are the hours of the Starbucks here. 6 a.m. to 9 p.m. Sunday, Monday through Thursday, 6 a.m. to 9 p.m. Friday, Saturday, 6 a.m. to 10 p.m. That's pretty cool. So just a little ways down from your hotel room you're staying here and you'll probably recognize this place the brass four they've had it at both the sunset and the palace station it's a 24-hour restaurant we are in the month of november right now and they do have a two course thanksgiving dinner from 11 a.m to 11 p.m available right there got some nice pastries and stuff keep moving on so over here is game on this has happy hour from 3 p.m to 6 p.m monday through friday kid you not so if you want to get all your drinks on for 20 bucks 3 p.m to 6 p.m check out game on right over here that's a hell of a 
deal. And right next to it is the broiler steak and seafood. They also have some daily specials here, some craft stuffed Maine lobster and all you can eat snow crab, choice of pasta on Friday, Saturday seafood boil, and build your own fisherman's platter on Sundays. Some of the other things on offer here, New York, $42, prime rib here, mac and cheese for sides, onion rings. It's got my name written all over it. Tableside brownie bowl Sunday. Look at that. Yum yummers. Wednesday through Sunday open at 5 p.m. for the broiler here. There are some of the specials we were telling you about earlier. They don't have happy hour here at the broiler, but you can go next door where we just were for game on. Or you can go to the next spot, which is coming up here. I'll turn to the left real quick. This is Kicks Bar. Typical casino bar. But here is Cantina Cerveza and Tequila. And they have happy hour available Sunday through Thursday, 2 to 6 p.m. So you can come here and get happy hour and then go to Game On and get your happy hour on. Let's keep going. Looks like a nice restaurant. Chino's moved over here. And then right ahead is the hotel lobby. And then we'll, we'll see our loop over here. There's the Havana Lounge. And this is where we came in, right over here. I'm gonna take you up through the middle of this casino and there's a nightclub here as well and live entertainment venue, which is in the center. But when you come through this way, they have a really cool stained glass up here. Just look at all these machines. I mean, it is wall to wall. Every nook and cranny in here has a machine. beautiful stained glass boulder station. How cool is that? And here's Railhead. So they have a power and radio station, no cover on Friday nights, but they're currently closed and they've got live acts here as well. And then right back off to your left is where that food hall is. And over to your right is where the theaters are. All right, let's wrap up this video. This is Boulder Station. Got a couple of thoughts for you at the end here. So let's get to that. do it for another edition of where's my coffee where's my room for boulder station here on the east side of town right off boulder highway and nellis not the greatest neighborhood but hope you've enjoyed this tour one thing that is cool monday through friday twenty dollars all you can drink happy hour 3 p.m to 6 p.m so hey if the neighborhood bothers you you can maybe drink yourself away all right everybody if you enjoyed this video please hit that thumbs up and subscribe to j and k stay in vegas also turn on those bell notifications be alerted to every time we post a new video just like this or when we go live like we do every Saturday night. All right, everybody, until the next one, stay safe. Oh, you know it. And stay silly. Bye-bye, everybody.